Meryl Debs, and I'm the co-founder of Red Sneakers for Oakley. And Oakley's mom. Oh, and I'm Oakley's mom. <laughs> you want to say it again? Do it again as Oakley's mom. We're here today to help support and bring awareness of food allergies. And we're here to help people understand that food allergies are real. They're not a fad. And they can be severe and they can be life-threatening. We started an organization soon after Oakley passed away from ingesting a piece of cake that had walnut extract in it. He wanted everybody to know that his favorite shoes were red sneakers. That's why we started this organization and we call it Red Sneakers for Oakley. My name is Jay Budishwar. I'm the uh, deputy town manager for the town of Palm Beach. And we're just happy that we can have an event like this that honors his memory and brings uh, families and kids together. We're very excited. The town has a great partnership with uh, Red Sneakers and the Friends of Recreation. We're so happy to see all of these kids, all of these families out here doing the thing that Oakley loves so much, which is play soccer on this incredible field. So I'm just very happy to be a part of this. Today is about celebrating Oakley's life and the community coming together to remember Oakley. Oakley was such an important part of this community and just looking at all the people that have come out today is so heartwarming to know that all of the people that knew Oakley are now his ambassadors to spread the message about the dangers of food allergies. And not a day goes by that we don't receive a testimonial about how Oakley has saved another life. We have over 100 testimonials of people that uh, have read our information and have come back and said that they've saved their children's life. A family in North Dakota read about his story and they knew what to do when their child went into anaphylactic shock. We're saving lives and that's why we're all here. So happy that we have this day that we can attribute to my son. They're naming the field in his name. This was a really important part of his life.